So today we're going to do um, how to create button in Adobe Flash and it works. So we will go straight to Adobe Flash. This is Adobe Flash and uh, we're going to work with the action script too. So we're going to work with this. So you must make sure that your computer has this. So click on this one. So we have it. This is, uh, this is our tools. These are our properties. These are our working areas. We have our timeline here. So let us decrease it from here. Like that one. So we want to create buttons. So first thing that we will do, we will go and look for buttons. Um, so first we want to bring the buttons, but before we want to go make something play. So we're going to take this one. Over two, then going to draw over not oval but circle. Sorry, this one. Then remember, we only have one layer, so let us name it ball. Ball, we have it here. So, here, right click, right click on this. Then, after you've right click convert to symbol convert to symbol symbol ball ball make sure it is graphic graphic it is center then click on this ok nice so after doing that now we have our symbol here now right click on this don't right click but right click here right click here right click then create motion twin then after I've created motion twin here this is what will happen i want to stretch it to 55 that is so we'll take it and bring it here see this line so let us try it what will happen exactly so we want it we can extend it here we can also make it curve yeah so look at what will happen nice nice now you want to create our buttons now go to windows because uh, because we want to create uh, the buttons what we need to do we have to go to windows choose common library windows and choose common libraries here then we go to button then you will find different buttons here these are buttons so we can choose the button kind of button that we want yeah there's so many buttons here so you can also search for buttons here we have this button we have this button we have this so what we're going to do we're going to create another layer here create another layer name it button button after naming it button now the uh in the frame one let us drag it drag the button we only want three buttons drag the button one button two button 3 so let us name them maybe let us name this one play play so I have typed play with the typing tool then when you go to property you can change the color into maybe black play then the, the second one, I'm gonna name it pause. Then the other one, I'm gonna name it stop. This one, stop. Stop. Yes, stop means the ball should stop. Nice. So we have these ones. So we need to click play. Look at what will happen nothing is happening still nothing is happening 
so we want to start coding these ones so what we're going to do here click on the first one here which says play then come into action or you can right click then action action this way then inside the action uh, field type on then release this one double click on release then you want to tell it what to do so i'm going to open and close bracket again the tough bracket i call them that way then i'm gonna type play and close and semi just like that so before we do anything let us go back so you see our the ball is just playing we don't want the ball to play until we press play so if you want that to happen come here the first one or here you can do any click here click on the first one here then type stop for the button not to play just like that then when you do this the ball will the ball cannot play now until we tell it play why is it playing it is playing because when you click on the button action action here with on release then play so this means that when you press when you press it then play i'm sorry for that i should place my chords in a better place yes. when released play if you want to inspect your chords to know if they are right just click here to check zero errors zero warnings thank you so the play button is now okay so you want to work with pause so for pause you're gonna do this action so we're gonna give it this code on release double click on this close when press on release when pressed it's something like that then you tell it uh, now what you do jump down that is pause so this is the code to pause I'm gonna tell it stop stop then close bracket and semicolon then let us test it this is the code for pause button on release close open close then stop let us see what will happen play pause play pause play pause thank you then we want when you press stop it starts afresh so what we're going to do here we're going to click on stop then give it a command to stop then we're going to say on open release like that then we gonna tell it open these tough brackets and call them tough brackets because they are strong wow. then we're gonna give it this word go to and stop go to and stop frame one so this means that when i press stop this means that when i press when i press on stop button which is when i press on stop button which i've selected then i'm telling it go to and stop at frame one so it will go and stop at frame one where it starts so frame one this is the first frame so you will start from here so go to and stop it will stop here so let us see play pause stop you see that is how you make buttons play pause nothing stop play wow the 
that will not take you back. Actions. This is the code for play. This is the code for stop. This is the code to release. So that is how to create button in Adobe Flash. And uh, Thank you for watching this tutorial. Thank you very much for watching this tutorial. Bye bye.